Hi, I'm Peter Schultz. In this video tutorial, I will show you how you can use the Data Publisher to create a publication. I have already created table CSV demo products for this demo, and I've also added some rows for this demonstration as well. Let's create a publication for table CSV demo products. Start the publisher. Click the Add New button to create a new publication. Enter your publication name. Select your database and table. The database list box shows the WordPress database by per default. That is uh, Bitnami WordPress in my case. To use a remote table, for example, you can select your remote database and your table list will then be updated so you can select an, a table in that remote database. Now, for this demonstration, I will use the standard WordPress database and my CSV demo products. And for now, I will just use all the default settings for a publication. So let's submit and well, your publication is ready to use. Click the test button, the test preview. And well, here you can see a preview which looks different in your dashboard than it will look on your website. The preview in the dashboard is just meant uh, to check whether your publication runs correctly or not. Now, the next step is that we would like to add this publication to a web page. Uh, well, um, go down with the mouse a little and click the copy shortcode button and you will see that the shortcode was successfully copied to the clipboard. So I will switch now to uh, the uh, website, edit the website. Now I will enter the uh, shortcode here. It's on my clipboard, right? so I just uh, enter it update the page, view the page, and there is the CSV demo products table. So you're done. The, um, you, get, you can do a lot of styling. Uh, you can just add your own CSS. Um, you can also uh, change a lot of settings in the data publisher page in the, in the data entry form. And um, there is a section table option advanced below here that allows you uh, to add more advanced features and options like changing the structure of your publication, handling publication state, or even adding your own JavaScript functions. Please check the website, the plugin website, for more information about uh, styling, uh, about settings, and about advanced settings. Well, that was it. Thank you for watching.